Shabbat Shalom, overcoming obstacles. In order to build muscle, you actually have to exercise to the point where you're damaging the muscles a little so that when they heal, they grow back bigger and stronger. The same is true in life. We face obstacles that are difficult, but they help us become stronger. In this week's parasha, Yaakov is dying, and he gathers his sons together to tell them something important. In Hebrew it says, which means, I will tell you what will happen in days to come. But the phrase, days to come, can also mean the end of days, like the end of time, when the Messiah will come. But Yaakov does not then tell them about the end of time, which has spun many rabbinic comments as to why. The great Hasidic master, the Svas Emes, taught that the struggles that Jews will go through leading up to the end of time are for the purpose of cleansing and purifying and polishing our moral character. And if Yaakov told us when the end would come, as if it were a definite set time, no matter what we did, then no one would bother to do anything beforehand. We would simply wait. No one likes to have obstacles or struggles, but ultimately those are the things that challenge us and push us to be the best person we can be. If we knew that the obstacle would be over at a certain time, we wouldn't bother to try overcoming it, we too would simply wait. So it's actually better not to know when some challenge will be over so that we can take advantage of it as an opportunity for growth. We look forward to seeing you this Shabbat at TRZ as we celebrate the Bar Mitzvah of Ben Goldman Friday night at 7.30 p.m. and Saturday morning at 9 a.m. Shabbat Shalom.